Hi everyone, I am Astha and today I'm going to talk a bit about the American Express data scientist interview process. Okay, at the end of this video, you should have a good understanding of the process itself, what the interviewers are looking at and a bunch of tips for each round. For context, the American Express DS interview process can be very, very different for different openings and our goal is to get you ready for the most common situations that you might face. As a quick intro. I am from Prepfully. This overview has been put together by American Express data scientists who are also interview coaches on Prepfully, the very same ones who have helped hundreds of candidates with mock interviews and advice. This is a video version of our much more in-depth written guide which we will link within the description and you can always book time with the coaches directly and for more personalized guidance on Prepfully's website. Okay then, moving on to the overview. As a part of the American Express data scientist interview, the candidate will need to go through three primary rounds. The first one is a recruiter phone screening round. The second is a technical round and the final round will be an on-site interview. Let's talk about step one first, the recruiter or the phone screening. This stage is divided into two rounds, a recruiter screen and a behavioral interview with the hiring manager. Recruiter screen. The initial screening stage where the recruiter will ask general questions about your background and provide an overview of the interview process. Hiring manager. Behavioral interview. The next stage is the behavioral interview with the hiring manager. The manager will ask questions about why are you interested in this company and what are you looking for in your next role. The manager will also talk about their background, the history of the team and the current needs of the same team. Some tips for getting through this round. Make sure to brush up on your previous work experiences and have specific projects to discuss from each role. Now before the interview, take some time to organize your thoughts and reflect upon your contributions, on your successes and the areas for your improvement. Keep your answers concise and to the point. This is very important for candidates to keep in mind because derailed answers can often make this interviewer lose interest. Have a solid reason why you are interested in working at American Express and why you believe that you would excel there. Be prepared for the common opening question of tell me something about yourself and have a brief introduction ready to go. Next then is step two. The second primary round of the interview process at American Express is a technical interview round. This is a crucial stage in the selection process where the candidate's technical skills and knowledge are thoroughly evaluated. The primary focus of this interview round is on machine learning. For instance, a candidate reported that the ML questions came with a focus on customer acquisition for credit cards. Now, it is important for the candidate to have a deep understanding of the concepts and the techniques of machine learning and to be able to apply them to real world scenarios. They should also have strong communication skills and be able to effectively explain their thought process as well as their reasoning. Some candidates also reported that working with an ML case study was a part of the interview. Here is a tip for this round. Brush up on your machine learning knowledge and be familiar with the most common algorithms and techniques. The third and the final round is the on-site round of the interview process, an in-depth evaluation of the candidate's skills and abilities. During this stage, the candidate will meet with approximately five team members and managers one-on-one -on -one and is expected to face multiple rounds of interviews. Some of the rounds you can expect to face are behavioral round. During this round, the interviewer will ask questions about the candidate's past experiences and behavior in specific situations to assess their fit within the company culture and values. The candidate should come prepared to answer behavioral questions and provide examples of their leadership skills, communication, style and problem solving abilities along with other relevant experiences. The other life coding round in this round, the candidate will be asked to demonstrate their logic and approach to coding. The interviewer will ask the candidate to write code for a specific problem and discuss their thought process and design choices. The quantitative round. In this round, the interviewer will ask questions focused on mathematics. The candidate should be prepared to demonstrate their understanding of mathematical concepts and their ability to apply them to the real world problems. 
A candidate also reported to us giving a presentation on a specific topic and answering technical questions related to it. Please note that these are just some of the examples of the rounds that you could face. However, the rounds can be different for different roles and for different positions. Apart from the stuff already covered above, we have four tips for you. Okay. Prepare to answer behavioral questions and provide examples of your past experiences. Be ready to demonstrate your coding skills through live coding exercises. Brush up on your mathematical knowledge and be able to apply it to the real world problems. And be prepared to give a presentation and answer technical questions related to it. Okay, good. That is all from us. Once you feel ready for some practice or just want to get a sense check of your preparation level, you can book an anonymous mock interview with a data scientist from American Express on Prepfully. There is a link given in the description below. In addition, I have linked a bunch of useful resources in the description, most of which are free. There is a written guide, there are several interview questions and if you have follow-up questions about the interview, why don't you ask in the comments below? And if you found this video useful, do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Thank you and good luck. Thanks for watching the video. If you liked it, please subscribe. Our website is prepfully.com. We've got lots of interview questions there. You can also schedule a mock interview with one of our experts. You can find the link in the description below. All the best from us at Prepfully. And we hope you totally rock your interview.